no big camera today. And I don't know, we probably won't even take the camera out walking at all. It has been raining off and on all night. It rained some this morning. But you know who, who happens to be back here laying on the floor, wants to go for a walk. She started dancing and carrying on and all that. So I don't think that there'll be much in the way of, we'll go to Wanamaker and we'll just stay close to Trevor. We'll walk around in the green area or something. Just to, and if it starts raining, we'll be close enough to the van that we can come jump back in it. I keep looking at the radar and it, uh, little showers popping up here and there. For a while it looked like we were going to be clear most of the day, but then you start seeing rain fill in. It's just typical summer, summer weather, but we've got a moisture from that low pressure down in the Gulf. We've got a moisture stream coming in off the Atlantic, so it hits warm temperatures and then poof, you got rain. So anyways, we're off to Wanamaker. I've never actually filmed these. Oh, our bug is back. Oh my God. It's nice and wet and damp and humid and we're not going off down in the woods. This is the cottonwood shelter. But I figured I'd stop here and we'd go walk out on the grassy areas and then we could come back here if it starts raining. And an idiot up at the light. Just sat there. The light was green. Said, yield to oncoming traffic. Which is normal, no green arrow. But apparently he doesn't understand that if there's no cars coming the other way, you can turn. I finally drove on to the left hand side of the road, went around both of them. They're just sitting there like bumps on a log. Upset me, upset Ruby. I saw somebody got stuck at a four-way stop the other day. Sign said stop. He was waiting for something to say go, I guess. <laughs> Most of us sitting at the intersection were just laughing at him. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the chance of rain down here today is you can feel it in the air. There's a lagoon, oh, this bug is right on my, landed right on my, right between my eyes. I am not going to film much down here today. I brought the little camera. <coughs> I did find out that you can do time lapse up to 20 hours worth, or it'll, it, it will take 20 hours worth of time and condense it with that. Canon Vixia. So I have to play with that. There, I, I started reading the manual last night and I was looking for the time lapse, but there's all kinds of things you can do with that camera manually that I won't be able to do while I'm walking Ruby because you need both hands to. I also found out you can actually draw on the screen. If you're going to point something out in a video, you can draw an arrow to it while you're actually taking the video. I think Alvin may already be out here in the open. Alright, this is going to be a very short video today. The wind is already blowing. There's not that many people down here. We're just going to get out and walk as much as we can because I just don't like sitting at the house. <laughs> I'm going to come around the bend here. That is Alvin. Ruby. He's right here on the, let's see if I can get over here next to the edge. Oh, it ain't Alvin, the big stick. Oh well, got me all excited. I miss Alvin. 
<laughs> Alligators are a good way to get your adrenaline going. A natural high. <laughs> All right, we're gonna walk. Bye. When we were down here during the CF walk, that's the path we took off. It's not a marked path. I don't even think it's a developed one. We took that to get over to the other side of the purple trail. This is the purple trail. To avoid the crowds. This bug that is pestering me. It looks like a firefly. But it flies around at supersonic speeds. I have yet to, I've smacked it a couple times, but it doesn't even slow it down. So, must be a kind of bug that's, I can actually see them flying off out there in the woods. It won't show up on this little camera. There it went right in front of me again. But it definitely likes landing on my head. It is wet down here. There not that many people. We had to get off the path twice for park employees in their golf carts. It is wet. It's like walking through a sponge. We're gonna go back out in the grassy area, get out of these woods. You can see how much water's on the path. That's just from this morning. But it feels like it's going to rain just about any time. I don't think we're going to get in a very long walk today. This park is buggy. I'll wait till summertime gets farther along. Then we'll come up here where we normally park Trevor. Walk down the grassy way that way. Get out in the open, maybe this bug will leave us alone. It's even gloomy off out here in the woods. Okay. I'm used to my bouncing with this little Chinese GoPro again. I really like that other camera, but I'm not gonna take it out in the woods when I think it might rain. Okay, we're just going to walk. This is the end of the today's... Ow, that thing is biting me. I know the bugs do bite. <laughs> the end of the video. I get out here in the open and maybe avoid some of those bugs. They're probably not going to get in, but maybe three quarters of a mile or a mile today. I'll come back over here and go down the grassy area, get out in the open away from the trees. Not even any squirrels out today. Saw two crows off the edge of the path having a tussle over what looked like some junk food. That was it. Okay, y'all have a good day. Thanks for watching. And in the little video, Rachar. Right